What's up you guys? Happy Vlogmas day three. I officially posted the first Vlogmas, but I'm trying to pack and get ready. I'm gonna be spending the weekend with my sister. It's gonna be a girls weekend with the kids. And we wanna do a bunch of like Christmas stuff, go to the Billy Graham library today, even though it's supposed to rain. We're not gonna let the rain rain on our parade, but I'm really excited. My sister lives kind of far away from where we are right now. It's like a two hour drive. So I'm really excited to spend the weekend with her. The kids are gonna have a lot of fun, but I'm trying to pack and I don't wanna overpack. I always pick out my outfits ahead of time. So I'm trying to pick outfits that I can easily mix and match. For example, this gray sweater, I wanna wear to church with some black slacks on Sunday. I have some leggings. I'm just gonna pick a few pieces and then mix and match them all weekend long. So you guys are gonna be seeing a lot of gray because it's gonna be this gray sweater. And then I have a gray sweatshirt. So I wanna pack light. This is why I love having pieces that aren't just like for one outfit, but you can wear tons of different ways. Like jeans, basics, things like that. So that's what I'm doing right now. And then I gotta do the kids clothes, makeup, skincare, although it's my sister's house. So she has, if I need anything, she has it. That's the beautiful thing. Like if I need makeup, you better believe I'm gonna use hers or skincare. We're always like using each other's stuff. So I don't know, I'm really excited. First things first though, I gotta shower. And then I'll probably do everything else off camera because it's just so hectic trying to pack and all that and get ready. And then I'll see you guys on the way there. I'm all packed up and ready to go. I'm just gonna make a coffee. I saved my Dunkin' Donuts cup from that one vlog if you guys saw. I don't know if anybody else does this, but I will like wash and reuse coffee cups. It might sound really nasty to some people. I promise it's clean and I'm the only one that used it. And it's not like falling apart. So it's just like my second time using it. But I knew that I was gonna be going to my sister's. So I'm like, okay, this would be perfect to take to go. I have like a homemade mocha syrup in here. Can't you see it? And then I'm just gonna add a shot of espresso, some steamed milk, and we're gonna head on out. I have my trench coat on because we're gonna be doing some outdoors activities today. And it just looks like a really gloomy, rainy weekend, basically the entire weekend. So we'll see. We're gonna try to make the best of it and hopefully do a lot of fun Christmas things that I can take you guys along for. We finally made it. I stopped by Aldi and picked up a few things. I got some Christmas pizzas for the kids. I found their limited edition peppermint cold foam. So I wanna try that out. You can put it in like hot chocolate or coffee drinks. I already tried it and it tastes really good. It's basically like whipped cream, but it tastes like peppermint. I'm trying to find Cookie, which is Chai's sister. They were born from the same litter. And I just saw her. I want to show you guys. I feel like I haven't seen her in such a while, long time. There you are. Oh, you cute little girl. Look at you. You fancy girl. Oh, you're so beautiful. You're so beautiful. So this is Chai's sister. I totally wish we kept her. I convinced my sister to keep this one. <laughs> so now my sister has two cats. And I totally wish we took Cookie too. So it's Chai and Cookies. I mean Chai and Cookie. But I thought that was like a cute little, cute little duo. My sister's not here right now. Her daughters have lessons, so she's gonna be home. I just saw her and then she had to run out. She's gonna be home in a little bit. And then we're gonna head out to Billy Graham Library. My sister told me about this. They do something called Christmas at the Library. It's basically a free event. They have Christmas carolers. You walk around, I think it's like a museum. And they have a live nativity. And then they also have carriage rides, which we ordered tickets for. For that, you do have to pay. It's like twenty dollars a person i believe or no no it wasn't twenty dollars that was ice skating it's even less but it is kind of drizzly outside so we'll see how that goes it should be fine though because it's not like pouring rain it's just like here and there you'll see a sprinkle but i'm really excited for that so that's what's on today's agenda i heard you're a mischievous little girl Mwah. oh she's so sweet though and so beautiful like chai if i try to hold chai like this chai is like not about that life she loves eloise my daughter eloise she will sleep with her but she always tries to squirm out of my hands and then this one, I feel like you can hold her for forever and she won't leave. You're so sweet, but I hear you're so mysterious. I'm trying to make some snackaroos before we go. So I found these little mini quiches at Aldi. I think this is what I'm gonna eat and then make something for the kids because I highly doubt my kids are gonna eat this. And I'll let you guys know how these taste because they sound absolutely delicious. And then I've got some charcuterie stuff. They have really great charcuterie stuff at Aldi and I saw this really cool cheese. It's called, I don't even know, Tete de Moines Cheese Rosettes. I was like, what is that? But we're gonna see, I've never tried this before. Let me know if you have. This looks super interesting to me. I don't know. 
I had a package delivered to my sister's house. I bought her a gift on Black Friday and I wanted it shipped here since I knew I was coming here this weekend. So I'm just gonna wrap it up and put it under her tree. But Victoria's Secret was having a major sale on Black Friday and they have really cute flannel PJs. But their flannel ones were on sale for I think $35. So I got some for my sister in this really cute green and pink print. They're not like too Christmassy. I feel like you can still wear them throughout the entire year. And I just thought they were super cute. So I got her these flannel PJs to lounge around in. And then I also got her some Lash Links the refills in extra style extra she loves those I actually have some here with me this is like all of my makeup and hair stuff and just everything i didn't take like a hair dryer or anything like that because my sister has it so i'm just going to use hers but it's these right here so they first came out with pre-map styles where it was pre-mapped into a cat eye and now they have something called the medleys so i have extra and minks right here which lash links actually sent to me this is the same exact style as the pre-mapped it's just that now you have them in a tray with sizes 10 through 16 and my sister really likes these right here so i got her one on black friday but i got her that and these pjs and the way that i buy gifts for people personally is i try to think of things that they said and like pay attention to that for like because i remember i was giving some lashes to my cousin and i gave her some extra pre-mapped and my sister's like oh i love those i need to restock on those so i was like ding 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 christmas is coming i'm gonna get you some so that's like how my brain works i try to think of like what does the person need what do they want what would they like just kind of like really customize it even if it's something small I feel like they'll appreciate it a lot more if you really like put the thought into it to think of them and something that they would like and need and all of that. We're getting ready to head out. I wanted to show you guys my sister's other cat. She is hard to come by because she's like always hiding. She's a Russian blue. She's beautiful. Willow. Come here, girl. She's already trying to hide. She's already she's like, I ain't about that life. I don't need anybody to see me. Willow. She is not happy. Hey girl. Here she goes with her selfies. You're so pretty with the lights. I wanted to show you guys. We made it to the Billy Graham Library. The outdoors is decorated so cute. I don't know, it's probably like really blurry and bad quality since it's dark out. But they have these paper can candles in these paper bags all along the road. So cute! Oh my goodness. The kids are so excited. It's so Christmassy and cute here, oh my goodness. And there's a light, got the prettiest side for everyone to enjoy. Standing up close by the Christmas tree, glimmering light, I am right where I want to be. I'll be home for a couple of days, wander around with you. You and me in the cold, thought it never be true. It started raining literally like pouring this is so beautiful stop running there is no way trying you better loosen your belt drinking up wine by the fire don't care of anything else it's christmas and some kind of love my friend i'll pray it won't happen. oh hi girls to be here too It's Christmas and Outside snow's glistening It's just you and me tonight I'll spend all this Christmas with you Oh, it's such a charm Got you up in my arm There's nobody at the door you said I wish this will never okay, be Okay guys, over. we made it home. Changed into our pajamas. The kids brushed their teeth. We're getting them ready for bed. And then my sister and I are going to hang out upstairs. So the trip to the Billy Graham Library was really nice because it's super decked out for Christmas. We didn't get to spend a lot of time there. Our carriage ride tickets were for 8 o'clock. And I think you have like a 45 minute time slot of when you can go on the carriage ride. So I think they give you like 45 minutes. We got there a little past seven. So we were already kind of on a tight schedule. And they do have tours that they do. I think it's called Journey of Faith for the Billy Graham Library. And that takes, 
I don't know how long, maybe like an hour and a half, and the last show was at 8.30. So because the line was so long for the carriage rides, we didn't have time to do the tour, but the tour is free, so you can come back anytime. I think anytime until December 24th, but the carriage rides were really nice. Did you like the carriage rides, Eloisca? Did you like going on the horsey? She's like watching videos on my phone. It's one of her favorite things to do is like rewatch old Christmas videos and stuff. This is why I love capturing memories. They love doing that and just looking through my phone and watching all the videos. But while we were waiting in line, it started pouring. I mean like pouring. Luckily there was a little tent by where you get on the horses. So my sister stood under there with the kids and I was like the placeholder. I was like, I'm not moving. We waited all this time. I am not moving. But man, we got soaked, so that part was enjoyable. But once you're on the horse carriage rides, it's just so nice, super Christmassy. I'm not gonna lie though, if we hadn't paid for these tickets, because I don't think they're refundable, I would have just walked out and said, nope, we're not waiting in the rain, <laughs> let's just go home. But because we paid for them, and I don't think you can change the dates or anything, we ended up waiting, and I'm kind of glad we did. It was nice, it was nice. It's just a little unexpected rain on our parade. Hopefully it doesn't rain tomorrow because where my sister lives they do have a lot of like Christmas activities like ice skating downtown and stuff which I would love to take the kids ice skating again but if it's raining I don't know we'll see so we're gonna put the kids to bed I'm gonna wash off this makeup and then go hang out with my sister let's make a little charcuterie board I do it's a wonderful feeling from floor to these are so interesting they look like little carnations this is interesting. Like, I don't even know how to eat it, but it's cheese. Like, peel it. It's actually pretty good. You don't like it? I could eat it. Some kind of love, my friend. Pick up some candy canes and hang a wreath on your door.